guys, welcome back to some more Pixelmon. Uh, we just had a legendary spawn on us, so I think it's let's up go there. Yeah. Let's go hunt that down real quick. Which, you think it's that way? Okay. It's it was the only area close enough. I think it's right here. Yeah. Dope. I'm killing it. <laughs> Ghost, where are you? Where are you? Right here. You. Catch your your legendary in that. Ooh, nice. I have six of them now, so I've got some drives. Same. Drives. And I now have Galadite. Yes, and you can actually hit this one, so it'll be good. So you're doing yep. Palkia, right? Yeah, not Giratina. Oh, fucking Giratina, yeah. You'll need a pincer. Your Which pincer's I have, probably 50, so. But it's not. What level is my pincer? I pumped like 20 rare candies into it just to actually be able to hit the. Also, Giratina. ginormous baby team for the fossils. I just need to level those guys. Yes. Well, I need to EV train, then level them. Yes. There is... My pincer. 46. Okay, so if you wanted to rare candy it up, but I don't know if it's worth uh, it. I'm gonna save the rare candy for the late. If you're super heavy, you will easily catch it with a heavy ball. Yeah. I keep forgetting that I have my elytra on. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Red chain. Lustrous orb. Dun 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 dun. Which of that? It's not going there it anywhere. Is. There. It's shiny. No, really? Yeah. Okay, it's really tiny. It's not shiny. Uh, the it had the red glow, and that's what the shiny one looks like. So I said oh. it was shiny. The shiny Mega one is evolution. Thunder wave. I think this one might actually not be ordinary because it's kind of pitiful. <laughs> it's oh, pretty small. By the way, ghost. Uh, for our shiny battle, my shiny magnezone is perfect nature with the perfect hidden power. What? So, have fun with that oh, one. I need, I need to check a couple you. of my Pokemon to see if they're any oh. good, yeah. Yeah, your evolutions. See Which how much of Oof, that does not do a lot. Use magical leaf. I'm just gonna sword dance a couple times. I'm definitely gonna be doing It's only using ancient now. power on me, so it's not hurting a lot. Yeah. Also, I got most of my moves hits done earlier. Like, I got put TMs and junk on Pokemon, but I still need, like, move tutor moves, so. Okay, it's got Dragon Breath. That's, like, only good attack. Now it's move. at 1 HP. There's Aqua Tail. Hey. Is it paralyzed? Yeah, it's paralyzed. I, I paralyzed it immediately. Alright, GS Ball. Did dusks. <laughs> Dang, it almost got. Oh, look at that flying animation. That's dope. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Oh, look at that, yeah. One Back shake. Ball. Two. Three. Easy catch. Nice. <laughs> Here's your GS ball back. Dope. There's a, a ghastly just falling forever on the side over here. Is it shiny? You can just sort of no. You can just sort of see the head falling down there. Oh, that was shiny. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. Well, I guess I'm committing to this. All now. right. So nothing else <laughs> that we need to. Oh, there's a Mega Latios over there. Shiny. Go for it. Cause I'm falling. I'm... Oh, We're gonna be back my... there by the end though, cause I need to do my uh, Palkia as well. Let me get my Lake Spirits out so I can get some levels on them from this. I didn't even need to get Tapu Lele out of the box. Get more of hi more height than I did, because, oh boy, this is not going to end happy. Oh, did you guys know oh, wait, you can no. like you can ride and fly on Magnazone, by the way? I learned that today as well. That's crazy. Oh, and uh, by the way, it's underneath the, the building. Not building, the... Um, Let's see. Pressure. The island. It's, it went under the island, Ghost. Oh, I lost impish. sight of it. And I'm 200 blocks up, and I think I'm going to crunch. <laughs> all right, I'll see if I can find it. If not, I'll just fall out of ultra space. Not a big deal. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of not a spawn frequently. I mean, it's just a boss, too. Like, Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not like it's a huge loss. I'm just kind of like, oh, I, I lost mean, sight of it. And... Could have been a park ball. <laughs> We've only gotten one of those so far, right? Yeah, this guy got one. He used it on his gear, you know. 
That's the one that gets you called a cheater. Yeah. Uh, that and no. the GS will do that, but GS will have been around for a while, so. Yeah, it despawned. That's fine. Yeah, I'm sorry. Mr. Trainer, please have a couple Pokemon so I can use you. And you had to have you just had to have a Geodude, didn't you? Alright. Didn't so have Sterling. I have twenty six rare candies, which means if I get these guys all to level fifty two, then I'm done. Nice. I had a pretty solid trainer to use. He has you know at what? least four Pokemon. I'm going to focus on training up my actual teams today, and then we'll save that for another day, because we already got one legendary today. I'm doing mine today, so. We have two Palkias. And that's my last legendary. That's my last, uh, not my last legendary in total, but my last, uh, Gen 4 legendary. And probably my last one this season, because I don't, uh, don't think I'm going to have time to do any more. Alright, so I only have two Eeveelutions that I need to train up outside of the ones that are in my party. Savage. Um, I need to get you guys all your lucky eggs back. Wait, he just sent out a Rattata and not an Ekans, meaning he probably has another poke. Savage. And then I can kill this one, or I can just freeze it. Where was my other Sick. lucky egg? On guys, Crocodile. Savage. Oh, um, are any of you guys near my house? No. Uh, nope. Oh shoot, I, I was not paying attention. Oh well. That's fine. I need to grind my uh, Lake Spirits for my last legendary. I was just gonna show you guys the uh, ginormous fossil team. Just remind me to before the end of the episode. They look amazing. Okay. I especially. <laughs> it's like, what's pushing me? Alright, back to. I think I'm gonna do training. some ghost tower training, though. Just make Good sure luck. Two, three, four, five. Okay, they all are EV trained. I just want something a little different than fighting the same trainer again and again. Yeah, although it's the same trainer again and again is fast, and you have like five teams. Actually, it's nighttime, isn't it? Mm hmm. Yeah. Go hunt that Mr. Mime. Yes. Yeah, that is a thing you can do. I'll just fight things on my way while I'm searching for it. Stupid trainer with only two Pokemon. But then I just need to EV train my fossil team, get my last couple EVs up. I've got all my moves planned out for my three teams. I need yes. to actually figure out some good moves for my original main team, but that's only five Pokemon. They're also probably not gonna be the hardest to get moves for. Oh no, it's. I mean, like, one of them is a Grand Ninja, so that's gonna be. I think I already have all the good moves on most of them because they were my mm -hmm. team for a long time. Yeah, one of them is a Gyarados. What's which shiny like Pancham look like? Brown. Okay. That one had a leaf in its mouth that was a different color green that I'm used to seeing, so I was like, eh, I don't know if I want to walk all the way down there or not. Nah, yeah, the, uh, the shiny one's brown. Come on, Mr. Mime, spawn for me. Said you found yours by the fishbowl? Yeah, I found a bunch near like, where my home was, though. Near my, uh, my house. Well, if you do see one tonight, let me know, but... I'm in the ice bikes. Can I get this the last bit of training done? My shiny right here is my last one. What? I, I ran far enough away, but they didn't reset. Uh, sometimes Pokemon just don't despawn. It takes, like, a while sometimes. sometimes well, I think it's they have to not only have the, the check to see if they die happen, yeah. Like, it, it has to check while they're farther away. Yeah, which means, like, if you run away and they don't do the check while you, like, and then you run back. They just stay there. I usually just look at my mini-map and I see the entities despawn, then I go back. Mm-hmm. One Mr. Mime. I get six Abras and a Phantom. On, 
I just need a couple more Pokemon. You need Mr. Mime, Kangaskhan. A Lapras. A... Oh, a... Yeah, like I need I need the hard to find ones from that generation. Lapras is by far the hardest one to find. I think there's like oh Snorlax. And then that's the Lola that Geodudes. Have you ever gotten an Onyx? Uh no, need an Onyx too. A Lola and is really easy. Like you yeah, just, I just, I just like, need to head to the Extreme Hills, I think. The Extreme Hills M. That's where you want to yeah. go. Is there a good Extreme Hills M? Yes, the one next to the Muse spawn. That spawns oh. Lolan Geodudes very frequently. Okay. I got like three like the, there in like the one night. They, they spawn like 50 50 chance with normal geodudes at night. Oh, I thought the Mr. Uh, Mime was also in jungle, but that's fine. I think it used to be. That's what I was thinking, yeah. Go Actually, check that like... new root forest that I chopped down the other day that I just remembered about. See if that one had anything. I'm gonna see if there's a Mr. Last Mime couple over Pokemon. Here. You didn't mess with Mr. Mime's rarity, right? You left it at defaults. Default I didn't mess with time. anyone's rarity. I forgot to. No, I meant like a little bit at all, like. No. Because Mr. Mime's default should have been like 25. I didn't think they were that. too rare. I just haven't had any luck finding them. Why are these trees not? Did I miss a chunk? Oh, apparently I didn't. Uh... My my axe must have broke when I was vein mining these guys, or I just straight up missed them. Oh, Mr. Mime's a 35. That's, I'm pretty sure, default, though, so. I just walked over a bunch of junk. I just have not seen them at all. They spawn in birch forests as well. So I'm gonna go check my cut down birch forest. Did you already have your Mr. Mime? Me, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was wasn't sure if you saw them, but never caught them because. Oh, I've seen plenty that I've never caught. Okay. That I usually killed because they have level fifty Pokemon. So. Are you Extreme Hills M? It's all gravel. Oh, gravel on you. Extreme Hills plus M. Plus M? That's where Jirachi spawns. Stay there until after sunrise, because Jirachi's dawn dusk. Oh, we just had a legendary at the start of the episode. Oh, I guess it's been twelve minutes. If it's like literal minimum, it might be yeah. I might see an onyx or something. They spawn at like the top of mountains because they have a min Y, I'm pretty sure. I got rid of the min Y. Oh, that explains so much then. That's probably what caused them to spawn so much more like, rather than just the rarity chain. Yeah, because I, I figured that was restricting it to like very, very low footprint areas. And I'm like, you know what? Onyx should be a little bit more common. It's actually really like cool seeing the uh, onyx at the top of the mountains and stuff. It's really sick. Yeah. Mega Steelix still doesn't spawn, but oh well. It's, it's sunrise now. I should probably go. Actually, wait. No, I can find Bulbasaur here. I do need Bulbasaur. I'm gonna do that. And then Snorlax is a forest as well. Snorlax? No, it's Extreme Hills as well. It spawns in oh, my house. Extreme Hills jump. Plus. Extreme Hills Plus M. Yes, that's why I see it closer to my gym rather than just in general. Yeah, that makes Afternoon, sense. Afternoon, dusk. All right, so I'll just spend my day up in the Extreme Hills training. Yeah, and lots of trainers spawn there as well. There's not nearly as many as Ice Spikes. I'm going to look for my Bulbasaur right now. Also killing every odd no. Boy, level 10 trainer. Because like one odd no gives the same amount as like three level 100 uh, youngster Pokemon. I like I love high experience Pokemon. I wish they spawned higher level. Actually, I wish Odno still mass spawned in the savanna biomes. Because mm. like every single morning, they would just be like, millions of them. But they move them to the virtual. Oh wow, that, that trainer was level ten and had a grand total of one Pokemon. I take it you have your level one fossils in your party. Nope. Uh, I have a level 18 Jolteon, but everything else is mid-40s. That would be what caused it, then.
hurricane. No, why would you? Oh, come on. Hmm. What yeah, happened? Mega, mega Pidgeot that uh hit me with hurricane confused me, so my Twinkle Tackle didn't go off. Yup. I I hate it so much. That cost me so many battles with them is it being stuck in confusion or being paralyzed or something. I was just gonna run and then drop a healer, but get it actually up on the Extreme Hills Mountain. Kind of nearby ish. So. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, it didn't despawn. If it did, screw the stupid Pidgeots. Yeah, I care so much like less about bosses now because like I have kind of everything I need. I don't need the bosses as much. They're good for rare candies, I, though. Yeah. Yeah, they're good for rare candies, and that's very helpful if you're trying to, like, train levels fast. Mm -hmm. There we go. That Twinkle Tackle hit. Oh, all the good levels on my Pokemon. Um, Jolteon, you do need Thunderfang? No. No, Special Attacker. You want Thunderbolt? Don't want last resort anybody. Ooh, wow, an EXP on. I'm not even picking that up. Yeah. But um oh yeah, that's what I need to do. Uh hidden power Jolteon. What? Did you just oh, type Jolteon? Space two. Oh, space two. Uh yeah. ghost type hidden power. Unlucky. Oh and then my other one for the hidden power was the Sylveon. I need to get that out of the box. That sucks that it's ghost type, actually. It's like a terrible... You get Shadow Ball. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I'll have to... Uh, I guess I'm going... Psyshock, Drain, Crit... No, that's... That's... Nope, that's Sylveon. Bolt Switch, Shadow Ball, Thunderbolt... There's nothing else for Jolteon. It doesn't get anything else. It's just... It's bad. Uh, Sylveon has a fire type. That is perfect. That's a good one? That's what you wanted earlier, because you wanted to hit Steel types. Okay, um, so maybe not Draining Kiss. I'll just go with Moonblast. Yeah. Definitely go Hidden Power on Sylveon. Hidden Power Fire is too good. But then I don't want the Big Root. I was going to go Big Root with Drain Kiss for the uh, combo. Now you can have both things Sylveon's weak to. Oh, nice. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> it hey. That could have been a Jirachi if it had been five minutes earlier. Is it on you, Don, or? No, I'm in an ice bikes. I'm next to Extreme oh. Hills. Smash, are you near Extreme Hills? Huh? No, I'm in Birch Forest looking for a bubble sore. All right, then it's probably on me. I just don't know which section of this is Birch or uh, Extreme Hills and which sure one isn't. Pretty sure it's definitely you. I'm glad we we figured out ways to make the legendaries useful. Yeah, GS balls like, are really I, I feel like a lot of the changes there is the Entei. A lot of changes we've made have made the game enjoyable through the end game. Yeah, like we don't get tired of seeing entities anymore. I still would have preferred all their legendaries, but at the same time, that's a GS ball. Also, or two blaze rods. Oh, well, I guess if you're unlucky, yeah. I did make sure to give it a zero or one chance of a GS ball, so. Or zero, between zero and one, so it'll randomly pick. Ghost. Whether it gives one. Jolteon literally does not get other moves. Yeah, I know. I it think I might just give it. doesn't. Like. No. You can get Signal Beam. That's what you should do. Yeah, I was going to say that. I think that was the one I was looking at, which was near useless, but every once in a while I might have to counter a psychic type. It's literally better than, like, a normal type move, like Hyper Beam. You could put Hyper Beam there. Yeah. Or Thunder. You can use Thunder with Electrium Z to get a higher power Z move. Yeah, and the Z moves are guaranteed to hit, so. But do I want to use my only Z move on? Something I need, with no I need to look up Z moves. Like, and figure out, like, what I want to use. Because, like, there's no Megas, so I don't have to worry about a Mega for the, that team. See, Z moves are typically better being a typing that the Pokemon you're using is not. Like, say you're a pure water type and you have Ice Beam, you would, like, Icium Z because it hits grass types and you, you can probably kill something you would die to otherwise. Yeah. But Jolteon so doesn't... Coverage. You don't have any, like, 
you don't have a coverage move to counter something you're weak to, which you're only weak to yeah. ground, and you don't have a right hand power. So for what that. I would probably do is do Ghost Z on Jolteon. I did that on my Glaceon, and it kills Sky's Metagross. So <laughs> because the thing is, like, I don't want to do the electric because of course everybody's gonna see a jolteon and be like oh ground type time yeah or if you're not using jolteon for your z because you could use jolteon for something else um yeah maybe i'll give i wonder if jolteon i think jolteon can learn covet use it to rip items because it's fast i guess so i've never seen anyone use that before i don't think it learns covet it learns covet okay yeah, like dig. every every one of my evolutions had covet, so yeah, they do in fact give it. Where is this stupid Bulbasaur? Where's literally anything good in the extreme hills? Oh. I need Onyx or Snorlax and Ghost. Another thing you could do is you could run Thunder Wave. Yeah, that was the other. I know one. you ain't a fan of non-attacking moves, but no, Thunder Wave's pretty good because it's. Un impossible to remove like it doesn't fade yeah. off in three turns or they wake up one turn after you put them to sleep at a 20 percent chance to put them to sleep yeah it just halves their speed and has a chance for them not to be able to attack every turn sadly i can't get electro ball because electro ball thunder wave is a great combo yeah because you're much faster you can also get yawn and put them to sleep but i mean I, that might be an egg move so I think it is, and Plus also Thunder Yawn Wave's is kind of shittier because it takes a turn. Yeah, Thunder Wave is just there's too. Like much I'd rather have Thunder Wave just straight up miss than waste I mean, a turn. The, and then... There's also two typings that are immune to Thunder Wave, so it's the even fuck a bit is rough. that thing? Onyx. No, it was green. It's green boss Onyx. Green boss Mianfu. I saw its oh. ears at the top of its head, so it looked like a plant. And I'm like, there's no plant things that spawn up here. There are not. Could have been like a shiny, uh, shiny Jangmo. Yeah, I'll take an upgrade and a rare candy. Can't wait for upgrades to be super useful. I've got eight yeah. of each. I don't really know how well they're not going to be useful in this. You're yeah, next season. Those. Also, I don't think they're going to be super useful. I think you just need like one of each. Yeah, I don't really know how the TCG stuff works. I, I looked up what recipe uses it, and it's a card compendium. So it just stores your cards? So I don't know if it's an album or if it's a, hey, here's a list of all the cards you're missing kind of a thing. Oh, that better be something that stores your cards. Because I'm watching right now, each individual card is an entire inventory slot. It's so obnoxious. Yeah, so what they have is that there's a card deck or a deck case, which holds 60 that can be used in battle. And then there's card albums, which may or may not include the compendium, that hold more, but you can't use the cards in them until you take them out. Mm-hmm. Okay. God dang it, Swampley. Is it afternoon yet? I can't tell what the Yes, it's is. almost night, actually. Ah, oh, shit. Like, I really hate these Pokemon that I am missing left on my, like, to-do list. Because They're all they rare. Just do not spawn, yeah. Stronox is a 15 rarity. You definitely haven't boosted that at all. Nope. Because you would have said that's a 25. Maybe I should just go back to the Ice Spikes, train my teams up this episode, and then make these super rare spawns less rare. Do it next episode. I mean, yeah. Hunt. I'm probably going to be, like, hanging around in biomes where those, like, things spawn. Because I have nothing else to hunt right now. Like, I'm going for Bulbasaur during the day, and I'll check Lapras during Sunrise and Sunset, and if one spawns, I you will fly across the world and get to it. Because it's yeah, worth it. Cause it's it's pain. not... Bad training here now that Gravelers have started to spawn. Oh, I, see, I actually had a bunch of trainers spawning in the Extreme Hills before whenever I was staying there. Nah, there's no... I left not on the mountain belt. I'm on. What? What'd you say? I left the tidal bell. That's mine. Oh, Alright, it's yours? Yep. I'm assuming you mean the one in I the... Picked... Near the ice bike. Yeah, I picked it up thought it was guys. Oh. Sorry. I mean... I don't need a Lugia. I, I have <laughs> so many. I, I've killed so many Lugias. I don't need that. Whenever I get those, I just place okay. them. What about Shuckle? Are you guys any good experience? Yay! No. Terrible. They're not great. They're better than the Famfies I was killing. Well, I can believe that, yeah. Alright, how about you, Spinda? Are you, uh, HP 12? 
300 ish. Let's, uh, let's see about Wismers. The problem is it's hard to tell because they're all like very, very different levels. Mm hmm. Here we go. 45 Shockle. Let's see what this is. Well, first off, it's kind of a pain in the ass because it always has its berry ju juice. Uh, Sturdy, combo. yeah. Oh, that's only 400. I think the Gravelers are the best bet. One of the Rattatas from a youngster did like three times that. Uh, no. Well, on the level 100 ones. Yeah, level Gravelers are worth at least 500, though, so that's good. Garmory. Seeing any Snorlax or Onyx. Quickie. Onyx. Anytime. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a Rock Smash Pokemon. Onyx? It's not... It doesn't have to be, no. But who has Rock Smash? I know there was a Pokemon that... Picky Pack. I think I caught a Picky Pack specifically for the purpose of Rock Smash. Only issue is you're a flying type and you are going to get crushed. Do it next to a healer. I guess that's true. I just need to start the battle with them. Yeah. Honestly, just do that, yeah. Back here? No, I've already sorted it. Picky Peck is most recent gen. Yep, spawns in the jungle. You have Peck and Growl. What level do they learn it? Do you have a Trumbeak? No. Oh. Uh, or no, I think I might have a Trumbeak. Because that'll have it, because it learned it at level 9, so. Nope, I don't have a Trumbeak. Mm, just level to 9. I have two level 13 Picky Pecks. Mm hmm. So, do they get it? Let me just look it up. Wiki. Picky pack. Wait. Wait, why don't they have it at 13 then? What do you mean? Oh, it doesn't? The two picky packs I caught have literally peck and growl at level 13. Then, uh, you have some unlucky birds? I don't know. But they, they should have had four. Like, the code is designed to fill them to four moves if they don't have the four. I guess... Relearner of them? I don't think I've ever seen this berry. Hi, Yappa Berry. I mean, it's gonna give me a better chance at getting a uh, Onyx, so why not? Also, I wonder if... Uh, Gyarados has... Uh, or not Gyarados, fucking Snorlax has a chance at being inside of a rock. I don't think so. I would be surprised. It's raining at night, Squirtle. I demand your present. In Missile, that's... No. Not on Jolteon. Alright, one last sweep. See if I see either of them just hanging out somewhere where I wasn't looking before. Because that'd be a terrible thing, is leaving when it was in the middle of uh, spawning. Yeah. You're, you're going to try the Rock Smash? Yeah. Okay. I don't think I have a Rock Smash TM, which I think I looked through last time or time before for. So let's go back to spawn. Oh, I need two diamonds. I'll need a lot more diamonds later to get the moves on all my Pokemon that I want, but for right now, two will suffice. Yes. Door, let me out. Theoretically, a Squirtle should have spawned because it's raining at night. Hmm. And I'm not seeing a Squirtle. That's a trainer. Level 66, he can stay there. But I'm very excited for the progress we're making on the map for Season 2. Oh yeah, yeah. It's, it's looking great. Although I'm this excited. video might go up when Season 2 is close to coming out. I don't know. Depending on how many episodes hey. we have left. I'm watching you right now. It's the closest thing to an answer that you've given me, so I'm okay with that. 
Who knows? I, I hope so. I would like it to be soon. <laughs> By the time yeah. you have because you're only like I'm two episodes behind. Like, yeah, I'm maybe three, maybe two. I don't know. But that just means double pixel on for a couple days. All right, there's Spash. There is the relearner. Oh, that spawn town, by the way, is crazy. I went there earlier and a mess for spawn. It was nuts. It was really? in the well. <laughs> I guess it counts as water in the... <laughs> in forest by him, yeah. That is insane. All right, mover learner. I would like my picky pack. Learn a move. This one has skill link. That one has skill link, so it doesn't. Uh, so ghost Rock smash. Nice. As a note, ghost. Mhm. Mm the uh, the rock smash is a cooldown of twenty seconds. Minimum. That's fine. Minimum. The formula is 40 minus speed. Yeah, I don't expect it to be great, but it'll work eventually. I'm going to get a lot of Geodudes and stuff, but like I'm getting zero Onyxes. Also, I'm going to head to the uh, jungle now. Onyx has to be at Y is less than or equal to 70, but you remove that spawn condition, so probably not. Uh, ghost. Is that jungle from here? It is straight east. Nerd. Squirtle! No. Nice. But ghost, you want to maximize your chances? Mm -hmm. Do it in like a plains biome. Why? Because it doesn't have anything else competing. It has it at, when it's in a plains biome. It's competing with Boldor, Carbink, and Rog and Rolla. Unless the wiki's updated, but that's just what it says. Because everything else requires mesas or mountains, beaches, arids, mesas, mountainous again, beaches, rivers. Okay, well I'll give it a few tries, and then I can find a plains nearby if it's that. Cause it, Extreme Hills just have other things competing with it. Although one of them is a uh, a little injured. Yeah, and I need an all in Geo, dude. That's Extreme so. Hills M. Uh, Keyword Extreme specifically Hills Extreme Hills M, not plus. Yep, I'm in M. Alright, so. Rock Smash. Oh my god, it actually mines. Oh, like, wait, And what? doesn't guarantee an encounter. Oh, boy. Be here for a while. Good luck with that. <laughs> Unluck. I'm going to run around and check all of the Geodudes to see if any of them are Alolan. I think I caught the Squirtle. Caught the Squirtle! Like Alol Alolans are in regular M, right? Only regular M, not M+. plus. Regular, regular, regular... Ah, they're all bald. I need one with hair. You do indeed. Alright, that's my last Squirtle. I need one more Bulbasaur. And I guess I can go get that right now, actually. Although I'm not going to say no to this level 100 trainer. Or level 75 trainer. Yeah. It's worth it because you're training up your team. Multitasking. Lapras, where are you? Uh, can Picky... Yeah, it doesn't actually matter if Picky Peck evolves. Yes, it keeps it, as long as it keeps Rock Smash. Unless you still care about your your Gen Seven decks. Uh, I actually had two Picky Packs, so this will actually be better for the Gen Seven decks. All right, fair enough. Do not confuse me, you stupid Slowpoke. You got a Slowpoke on a Rock Smash. No, the trainer. Oh, oh, right. Well, let me find trainer. I see an actual Machoke over there. Yeah, that's fun. Do you have all that, like, evolution line? 
Um, yeah, other than the trade stuff that I need to do, like, I still have a lot of Pokemon that need to be, like, leveled up. Yeah, okay. I'm so far from getting the Kanto decks. I mean, I've, I've like, made a good go of it. If I don't manage to get it, I'll just get it next season. I'm going to probably do the full decks anyway next season, so. Yeah. Because you get rewarded for oh, it. Oh, yeah, with the rewards and all the shiny tokens and stuff at stake. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, like, it's, it's something you'd want to do, not just like you have to do. All right, Trumbeak, mm. let's try it again. Ah, uh, Rog and Rolla. Rog and Rolla is one of the things they would also be competing with in other biomes, so. You would have found that anyway. Well, I am going to try this really quickly. Uh. I hate looking for very, very rare Pokemon. I need to run and refresh the spawns and then come back. I'm going to try and rock smash in this plane so I'm over here and see what happens. My Trumbeak's in a lure ball. I love fishing for birds. <laughs> All right. Yeet, a rug and roller. Okay, that's not what I wanted. Now, does it stick around if you run from it, or is it... I can go back and check after I pick up this Lustrous Orb that someone left here, because I need this later anyway. Hey, a Mega Mall Wild Legendary. Rock and Rolla, you still there? No, it's dead. Have a close combat? combat. You got that from Rock Smash? No, it's just wandering. Or I can just one-shot my level 100 Xerneas. I wish I could... Iron like, I want to move the potion effects in the top right. I would like to move that UI. Like Fortunately, I don't think we have any mod that allows a rearrangement of UI elements. Another Rock and Rolla! Oh my. That is super rare. Holy shit. What is it? Oh, where's my, where's my, where's my, where's my tracer? What's it, what is it? It's a. I don't even know its fucking name. It's so rare. It's a Persimian. That is rare in the jungles. I just saw it and I'm like, wait a second, is that a plant? But no. It was a Persimian. It is indeed. Persimian's dope. It's like a football player. Oh, uh, actually, I see Persimian. Uh, it does have takedown at 22. This one is level 40. It's going to have double edge and stuff, so I'm just going to paralyze it and throw balls. Yes. Except for it probably has limber. Well, it didn't immediately get become immune. So oh no, no, no! It's not limber. It, it's never mind. Its ability is weird. It has its own custom ability. Like what receiver. It, do? it uh. Oh, it's like know. a football monkey. Yeah, I don't know what it does though. I think it oh, takes no. the ability in a double battle. Right. Copies the ability of a defeated ally. Then mm. what does power of alchemy do? I think it copies the ability of an ally. Copies the ability of a defeated ally. Okay. I okay, love when they so... make the same ability twice. Yeah. <laughs> That's like when they uh, advertise the Gen 7 Legendaries as having all new abilities and moves, and they were copies and pastes of clear body and uh, multi-scale. <laughs> it was great. Hello, youngster. Do you Have you seen any Bulbasaur? You know what? I'm going to throw a sport ball. It feels like it would be something that wants to get caught in a sport ball. It's not exactly a bug. It also did not want to get caught in the sport ball. <laughs> Hello, nighttime, Swab. Is it? It's uh, currently middle of the day. Yeah, okay. Quick balled it. Afternoon, technically, if you wanted to find your thing. <laughs> yeah, well, I want to catch this guy because I've never seen one of these out and about. Oh, yeah, they're super rare. Sadly, most of the balls I have do not do anything useful to it. Level ball. Yeah, level balls and timer balls are all I've got, really. Didn't even, like, do the animation on that one. It just hit me immediately after I threw the ball. Yup, it's like a probably starter catcher. I want to 
to weaken it, but I can't. So rare, I don't want to kill it. Wait, you said you brought your tracer. Not tracer, slasher. Oh, I was going to say, like, what, what ability did it have? Because it had defiant, that's crazy. That's hidden ability. It's a pretty good hidden ability, too. Oh, wow, it actually knows Rock Smash. That would have saved me some trouble. I just got Silicon from a piece of rock from using Rock Smash. Also, you, probably, you should probably use that fast hit me, because it's probably faster. If I can catch it. Oh, I thought you already caught it. Nope, it just used Rock Smash on me. Oh. It just keeps breaking free. All right, timer ball time. Damn ball. Stop breaking free, even though I know you have it 80% health. I mean, it's paralyzed. That should help for something. Doesn't seem to be. Problem is, I have my whole training team along with Slasher, so once he kills Slasher, the team's other ghost finally caught it. Nice. Alright, let's see what it had. It had... Receiver, yep. Rock Smash, Scary Face, Take Down, Leer. It's adamant, too. That's good. That's probably its best uh, nature. All right, back to the box, Trumby. But boom, that's Trumbeak's line down. Oh, you already had a two cannon. I found a wild one. I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no! I know. I never, never did get catch a two cannon. I thought you found a wild one. Nope. Apparently not. And maybe I killed a wild one or a two cannon boss or something. I don't remember. Oh look, there's just trombeaks all over the damn oh, place now. Hey. Oh, that's on me. You can finally I break that you. thing for your. Uh... I would. I would catch that. I would try and catch that. Cause you can break your fossil machine or your yeah your cloning machine. Yep. I mean, it's a good spawn. Use a good Pokemon. It's pretty cool. I definitely cool. want to save a shiny token for a Mew next season. Blue Mew is cool. I love shiny Mew. Alright, there goes your Lumberry. You're paralyzed, and now you're false swiped. Oof. Boards dance a couple times because you are kind of tanky, Mew. And maybe oh, I can burn some more time till tonight. I would very much like a Bulbasaur. That'd be dope. Yeah. I really hate when you hit a Pokemon and it, uh, you, like, get it almost all the way down on health, but not quite to one, and you're like, well, we gotta use another false swipe. Oh, yeah. Wow. One balled it with a level ball. Uh, legendary catches have been so great recently, except for Sky. <laughs> All right, well, I'm Sally, yeah. not going to complain about my third Mew. Hey, guess who hasn't gotten a, a Mewtwo from any of those? You haven't. <laughs> Watch you not get one out of the. No, no, you have to get one now. Now it's overdue. That's going to be so bad if it blows up the trade machine and doesn't. The problem is I don't have the diamonds for it anymore. Oh, you right. I don't really have those either because I use so many movie learners. Yeah, I'm going to have to mine it off camera. That'll, That'll be, fun. be fun. I have 19 diamonds on me right now. It I can probably make it. takes 27 diamonds per attempt, though. So Yeah. I have, I have three diamond blocks in the box, so hopefully I get it on the first try, but... You trying that today? my luck. Hmm? You trying that today, or what? Um, no. I'm gonna hang out in these hills some more. Okay. Unfortunately, I, I get that onyx. have used most of my diamonds in my gym. Alright, Passimian. Use Rock Smash! Rock and roll, uh... I guess I'm not getting a Bulbasaur today. It's sunset. Also oh. fast enough that it can actually escape. Oh, it's got enough speed. Oh, nice. no. Maybe it didn't. Uh, it's... Like, there is no zero cooldown. Yeah. The minimum is 20. I think it just bugged and then started the cooldown. It's not bad, though. It's got decent time. <gasps> what do you want, sir? 
Oh, well, that's kind of a shit trade. All traders are bad, yeah. It, it wants to take a Rotom and give a ditto. Okay, that's not a trade I've ever heard of in my entire life. Apparently in one of the later gens, it was a real one. Ah, uh, that might just be Pixelmon exclusive. I don't know about that. That's crazy. But I don't need Squirtle. a normal Geodude, so I don't need that. Ghost, is there a nighttime spawn that you need? Uh, Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime. Okay, that's something I can do at night then. I have nothing to spawn like look for at night anymore because I have my Squirtle. And then, oh, I guess dusk is the only time the Snorlax would spawn. And afternoon. I'm not seeing a Lapras. Oh, but I think I did just confirm that the, uh... Let's try this again. The what? Rock Smash. Run. Nope. It does... Okay, so I need to actually have my, uh, Flasher in the team. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I looked at a different Geodude that happened to be right around where the Geodude was when I was in the battle with it. Mm-hmm. Would have been a nice, uh, if I could have been able to randomly pick it up. All right, oh, wow, Mr. Mod. good number of trainers out here now. I think that was the first wild trader I ever saw. I've seen a couple, but they've never been, like... I really wish it was just random Pokemon, random Pokemon. Uh, with limitations. Well, no legendaries or mystics, but... I just feel like you'd be, like, really crazy having, like, a Weedle for a Dragonite. Maybe sometimes you'd find it. I guess, yeah. Uh, see, I wish that wasn't the default. I wish that was, a con like, a config option. Yeah, there is just, like, I have to manually add in a list of all the trades I want. I mean, I could just write a quick script to generate everything one-to-one -one that I, you know, figure would be a fair trade. Yeah. That would work, yeah. But that'd be a pain in the ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it also would run the risk of a single comma being misplaced anywhere in the document and having massive issues. Yeah, having a trader spawn and blow up the entire server. Well, not that, but... You never know. Alright, come on, Passimian. Let's see what you got. Oh, so it's kind of funny, it's past Simeon, but it's got the ability receiver. Yeah. It's like the opposite ability it would have. Damn it, rock and roll yeah. again. Ugh, the cooldown on it is not great. Dig is super useful comparatively. Give me an onyx. Didn't give me an onyx. Rock Smash sucks. Traveler and not Alolan. That's a manky in the tree. Hmm. Come on, spawn something I Oh! Oh, hmm. oh. Onyx right. requires clear weather. Oh. That would probably explain some things. Yikes. It's been raining for a minute, too. It's been raining, like, all episode. All episode, but, like, for a while, I feel like, because I got my squirtle during the rain, I'm pretty sure. That was lightning. It's been raining a lot. Man, that's crazy. So you wouldn't even be able to get one for me if you found one. Well, yeah, if I found one from... I, I feel like Rock Smash can still spawn them without it. Or, like, with like without clear weather. But, like, Wild Spawn is only clear weather. Yeah. Which I see all kinds of Onyx ever since you, like, removed their, uh, their wide limit. Well, that's nice. I Hopefully see. that will continue. Because they always spawn on top of mountains. Because like, they need a bunch of open space. Yes. What? 
I found a Lolan Geodude. So I only nice. need one more. Nice. Are you actually like? Are you in the extreme hills? You're yeah. You're next to the jungle. Yeah, I'm right, I'm right where the Mew is. Yeah. Okay. Forests and birches at night, Mister Mime. All right. Boss Venipede down there. What's Venipede shiny? Uh, it's like a paler color. Okay, that's definitely a boss. I think more of an orangish. Oh, I gotta head down that way and you're to heal. Oh, look, another boss. Time it's a Mega Caesar. That's a really good boss. That's an easy really... kill. Yeah, a really bad one for Xerneas, though. Well, yeah, if you had a fire type, it's an easy kill. I'll just get ho out. Your Flareon could probably kill it. Uh, Flareon's already trained up. Oh, I mean, I think. disable leveling. I don't know where Flareon is. Whatever. He was just training it last time, so probably. Oh, my Trumbeak's evolving. Nice. No, it's not in my finished one. I think it was one I grabbed for just a round. Oh, yeah. I have a Sacred Fire. Thank you for the Rocky Helmet. Something I should never, ever, ever be using on my Pokemon right now, because you fall swipe, and then they hit your Rocky Helmet, and... Yeah. Not be good. Can confirm. I'm pretty sure I've lost Pokemon, like, Rock Skin and stuff before. Boss Venipede, give me a rare candy. Nope, that's a power band. Unlock. There's a wild Zatu over here. Those spawn like everywhere. I, I like sometimes I see them in like places they shouldn't spawn, like not jungle. Ah, no! I probably placed this. It's spider web. <laughs> Can the rain stop so I can get an onyx? I wonder if Alolan Geodudes have a higher spawn rate. If I just if they're just that rare and I just finally managed to see one. Are you sitting on top of a mountain? I am this... on that like flat area. Okay, they spawn they spawn below Y eighty. I am at seventy ish, so yeah. They're only a rare spawn, they're not like super rare or anything. I just haven't really haven't been refreshing spawns as diligently as I need to. I'm gonna go over there and I'm gonna find one immediately. And then where you're gonna catch it and then I'm gonna go do my Palkia. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan of action. We'll also say accept uh Lolan Geodude or Graveler and uh Golem. Don't forget, Lolan and Geodude are more white than normal Geodude. Oh yeah, that's the only reason I noticed that one was the right one. It yeah. Was pale and its arms look skinnier and frail. Mm hmm So it's, it's like less rocky, kind of. It's more like smooth rock. I would also accept a Snorlax. That's not probably gonna happen. I almost died. Hey, yeah, Galvantula. That's kind of cool. I'm about to find an Alola Geodude immediately. Watch this. It's a saw too. It's a piece of crystal. It's a shiny Magnemite. Okay. Yeah, I was trying to head away so it would refresh spawns again. No, I'm 100% going to find one over here. Boom. There's not, right there. Like the... Easy win. Really? Yeah. There, no, there's two. They're not that rare. Yeah, it's crazy. What? Just over that way. This one's kind of bigger, and then that one over there is kind of smaller. And there's a youngster over there. This is a smaller one. I'll get the bigger one. It's over there. It's a 98 youngster. Alright, you all get the bigger one. I say it's over there. What does he do? He walks the opposite direction. Over there doesn't help. I was punching in the direction. Oh, which way? is this? This way? It's right there. It's right there over there on the little hill. Oh, 
this youngster might help me. It's kind of crazy that Mega Evolution can happen on the same turn as an attack. Did it always used to be that way, or was that's it used to be the a point in it? You can only Mega Evolve you attack. There's another Alolan Geodude right here, by the way. No, I don't need three. I only needed two. Maybe it's like a. Maybe the time matters. Maybe it's more of a day spawn. It says any time in the wiki, but like the wiki can be wrong. It it doesn't work well with the uh Alola. No, I mean the physical time. wiki. Oh. The actual wiki. Do a quick search. Go dude. That is three Alolan Geodudes, two Alo two regular Geodudes. I have the Graveler. Boom. Is nice. Alright. And then what else do you need for that? For the Cancer Onyx. Decks? Onyx, Snorlax, Jinx, Kangaskhan. Do you have a Jinx? Lapras. Oh, no, I got Jinx. Uh, not Jinx. Um, yeah, I think there's Lapras, then. You do need Lapras. You need Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime, that's what I was thinking instead of Jinx. Yeah. Well, they're both creepy. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go to your home. Seeing as Mr. Mime doesn't spawn right now, so. Yep, fair enough. I will follow. Or get that. You can just die, yeah. I just need to go there for. I don't need to do my Palkia. I had to, like, rare candy and bury these things up, but that's easy, so. Yep, I almost got my Espeon level today. Uh, my Rapierior. My Rapierior is, like, I'm just gonna rare candy, it needs one level. Alright, my entire, every Pokemon, I do not need to level anything up anymore. I'm done. Alright, that's gonna be fun. Rhyperior. But, oh, I need an Alolan Meowth, too. That's just around your home, you can find that eventually. Eventually, yeah. Hopefully, soon. Fuck, why are there all these wooden planks, damn it, Sky? Yeah, that sounds like Sky. Or slabs, I should say. That may have been Sky. Could have also been Crit. <laughs> oh, hey, there's a Spring Saws buck. You don't see those too often. Yeah? I think it's probably Sky because I think Crit was mad when he saw what had happened to the house. Well, he did the jungle, and that's, I think, what's the stuff. The but slabs are just ugly, and they're sitting there next he, to the path. He kind of screamed at Sky about the slabs. So I don't think it was Crit. <laughs> No, I didn't think it would be. Alright, um... Boom, red chain. Alright. Come on, stop raining already! Don't you love it? Have fun with that Maybe onyx. Stupid onyx. I have stone right next to my house. That's in the plains by I mean, it might still come from Rock Smash, because it doesn't say other- It doesn't say clear weather for Rock Smash. But it says clear weather for, like, in general, I'm pretty sure, so. And usually, it still somewhat follows that rule, so. Well. I guess I can put my likes with the Guardians away. I'm done with them now. Sometimes it just doesn't give you anything. I hate that. I, I feel like it should at least give you some encounter. You can even drop a piece of cobble. All right. All my light Guardians are put away. I'm never going to get them out again. Okay. The sky wants one. Do one more Rock Smash, then I'm going to... Hop to hyper, uh, our ultra space. Oh, if you ever need rock to smash, I have got so much. I wouldn't mean, like, like place it, but I need so much like smooth rock that I've like dug out yeah, of that. Got a gem out of it that time. Hole in the ground. Or a crystal. But regular Meowth. Alright. Leave past Simeon in my inventory, or in my team, so it reminds me. And spawn wormhole. Ultra space yet again. I don't know why I keep putting the wormhole right at my house when I could just go towards the fishbowl so I wouldn't have to, uh... I thought it was by your house. Damn it. 
It is sort of, but if you go to the beach between my house and the fishbowl, like the sand on the edge oh, of the yeah, fishbowl, yeah, yeah, it puts you right on the pillar or the thing. All right. This saves you a lot of walking. I'll break this rock right now. Get an onyx. That's forage. Boom. Rog and roller. Yeah, it's. I mean, I could eventually get one. I don't think it's going to be that hard. It's just going to be slow. I see them all the time around Skies House, like on top of Skies Mountain. Ever since mm. you changed it, they're 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 like a bunch now. Oh, they spawn in Mesa. Yeah, they spawn on Mountain, like Mesa and stuff like that as well. Mesa's and Mountainous. Okay. Uh, okay. Right, so right here is where the altar is. Raining in ultra space too. That figures. And I'm in space. Yeah, look how close it put you. It did indeed. It put you like, on the hill. That's crazy. Huh? Ah, where am I? Land. Where am I? All right, that's not where I was five seconds have to ago. Log, yeah. I'm fine. I can break blocks. Is that a shiny or something? Hold on. Mm -hmm. Something blue up there. Oh, uh, it's a palpitoid. Oh. Yeah, Palpatine is another thing I usually, like, notice more often, because, like, it's more of a bright blue than anything else. Yeah, it looks like a shiny for most other things. Alright. Summoning! Let's see if yours is bigger than mine. What size was yours? I didn't actually check the size. Let me go shiny! Through. Mine's bigger, that's like 100%. Mine was ordinary, apparently. Oh. Oof, it was impish so dense. Mine might be that. huge, then. It looks it looks bigger. I feel like everything summoned is always ordinary for some reason. It might just be so that they fit on the uh, temple. Yeah, but I would like a ginormous, like, Giratina one day. Alright, easy half HP. That did some damage, but that's fine, because I'm going to catch you in a GS ball. Also, I looked up the percentages. It's 5% for Pygmy and uh, Enormous. What do you mean? Out of a spawn, it rolls a hundred dot, like, a, it rolls out of a hundred, and if it's 95 or higher, it's a Ginor or Enormous. If it's five or lower, it's Pygmy. Hmm. These must so have, like, 45 So you got a 10% chance of one of the extremes. Well, this is ordinary. Oh, wow, you super quickly pulled that it one. It stopped raining in the real world. Random chance at Onyx. Uh, yeah. What time is it? After it spawns in afternoon and dusk. I thought that it was Snorlax. No, it's both. Which means if you're in an extreme hills, you're double chancing it. Oh, it's almost night. Then it's probably not happening. But I'll go over here to uh this mountain. I, I guess. get two breaks if I hurry. I'm actually gonna go to my uh... house. I know Snorlax can spawn at my house. I'm gonna go to my house. Palkia, you can go in this box. Where is the box? You. Where's the rain lasted like a full day. Yeah. All right, all my Gen Four legendaries are chilling. I think I have every Gen Four legendary now. Nope, I don't have Priscilla level and Dark 70, Cry. So that's met if that's necessary. Yes, but it shouldn't be. I'm gonna see Traveler. if something spawns here. The thing is, I think afternoon is also like I think afternoon might include dusk, so just spawning afternoon and dusk might double up. For, like rarity. Yeah. I really wish it would display the correct time left on those recharges. Yeah, but that's just external moves. There's a Riolu. There's two Riolu. 
up to you, dude. Snorlax, wanna spawn? Or Onyx, another Riolu. You wanna miss Sunset by the time it recharges? So there's three Riolus. Oh no, the Rock Smash Onyx because it says I can spawn at any time. So like I said, it expects you to do it in a cave. There's a chop, a Shuckle, another Shuckle, another Riolu. There's plenty of real loot. Well, uh, at least the past Simeon is a much better, you know, Pokemon for doing that. Oh, yeah, and it's super rare, too, so. It's obviously yeah. better. I mean, I, I at least caught one really rare thing today, so. Yep. You caught your Legendary as well. Yeah. But, I mean, Legendary was a guaranteed spawn. I guess. Not a guaranteed catch, but guaranteed spawn. I mean, they're really easy to catch, it seems, like all Gen 4 Legendaries are. Sky Master Bolt one. Mm. All right. Well, this seems like something off camera. Yeah. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And we'll see you next time when maybe I'll work towards getting Giratina or at least get some other stuff going. Get my fossils EV trained. Finish up leveling my EVs. We'll get closer and closer to the gym fights. Yeah. Yay. Goodbye.